Hello, I'm Oddball, and today in the media dimension... Quick, Oddball, use that camera spy thingy to peek into the lab. Why? Wily and Vitreus are fighting over who will be judging your case. Oh, this I can't miss. They might kill each other. No, Starman's there to make sure they don't. You have no chance of delivering that verdict. You are absent-minded and aloof. Better than you, who seems to have their heads so far in the clouds they can't see the earth anymore. And you have the courtroom skills of a sloth. You never judged a case where at least I was the lead prosecutor in 20XX for a good long time. Enough! This argument is pointless. Of course, because I'm clearly the best choice in this matter. No, you're biased against Vlad because he shocked you last time. Ha! You can't judge. So take that, I win. Aren't you forgetting that he froze you last time as well? So you are also out. Gah! Looks like it's up to me. Well then, there's only one thing left to determine. I'm prosecuting this case, or my dead body you are. That can be arranged. Ugh, they are dumb. They are going to fight for a while. Well, just be glad that Starman also had a prosecutor's license. I can't believe three people earned that in the one week that we've access to them. Well, sort of. What do you mean, sort of? Well, Vitreus earned his last week. Both Starman and Wiley just needed to get theirs renewed. Hmm, so they had them before. Yep. Out of curiosity, who do I want to win this fight? Well, I couldn't find much on Starman's old record. But his attitude is to strive for perfection. Vitreus's methods are normally to cause his victims great strife in anything. And Wiley had a nickname as a, uh, rookie killer. So that tells you that much. Hmm, so Wiley then. No, actually, you'd probably want Vitreus. He would probably try to prolong the trial to make you suffer, but that will also leave him open to losing. Is it sad that we're treating this entire thing like a game? Uh, no. Like I said earlier, preliminary trials are really just a way to make sure they don't waste time in the interim courts. Alright, it's time to start the next part of the game. They should finish fighting before I finish this. Maybe. Another round, let's see what we got here. Read this gadget. Penny is being held in the Amazon jungles. Rescue her from mad. This message will self-destruct. Right, Chief. I'm always on duty. You know, you'd think you would stop using combustible paper when dealing with this guy. And I'm still in my underwear. Ooh, look at the monkey. Okay, the monkey is gonna be an enemy, I guess. Get some stuff here. Ooh, I see it. And into the water. Well, that was fast. So that's the red pillar. Let's see what we got here. Kinda control it, and guess pick up the monkey. Okay, here's the teleportation thingy. Whoa. I can't actually reach this guy. Oh yeah, I can. There we go. Whoa. Let's just blow him the heck up. There is a good chance with, you know, things being in the Amazon being endangered, what I'm doing is illegal. But they are asking for it. Whoa. This has gotten weird. Oh, and I can't quite see them off screen when the camera does that. I'm, like, 95% sure those aren't natives. Those are mad agents dressed up as... So, yeah, that's kind of questionable. Oh, 
then again, I'm blowing up monkeys, so... Really, there's no winners here. Boom! Ow! Landed right on top of that guy. He didn't even blink. And giant fish that shed their skin? What the hell? Need to bust these fruits, get some bonus items, and there's the fish! Okay, now I know to watch for that. And to watch for the guys behind me. Huh. Uh-oh. Oh, they electrocute their bodies. Uh-oh. Stand at the edge. Okay, it's done and done. Whoa! This one has got a motor on it. And it sounds like we got a boss. Is it this these mad agents swimming up and down a waterfall? They have to be pretty good to be doing that. Are they in the boss? Oh no, I'm guessing it's Dr. Claw's chair again. very well where the boss is. And unlike Mario, there's no real way to get him to pan over and I just fell off the cliff. Damn it! You know what, let me get back to there really fast, okay? Ta-da! Just get back on the super fast speed boot. Which may be fighting with the current since it crashes right there. Okay, now, now we know what we're looking for. Dr. Claw. This is the most sturdiest chair ever. So, I kind of want to say this actually was a Dr. Robotnik thing before. You can destroy the little things that come out of it. Ow. Oh, you can even get an actual health upgrade. However, it's seek and destroy type, you know, pattern, combined with the fact that I actually have no good way of dodging. Oh, there we go. So yeah, just destroy the four cycling things and then take out Dr. Claw. All right, let's tune back into the real fight. You have all the intellectual know-how of an untrained goldfish. Well, you have the basic detective skills of an episode of Monk. Ouch, shots fired. Wait, 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 look, Vitrius. Throwing insults back and forth isn't gonna get us anywhere. So how about this? I get the case, and you can go back to watching My Little Pony for the rest of the trial. Oh, there is no way that Vitrius is going to. Deal. Good luck with your case. <laughs> huh? <laughs> you forgot who you're dealing with. No, I thought you would put the chance to torture me above ponies. Well, suck it up, Oddball. Because tomorrow we end this whole debacle. And your first case as a defense attorney will be your last. Wiley, I am going to make you wish that you stayed in the field of science. Tomorrow we fight. 